Good morning, world. What up, y'all? Colonel Slaughter coming to you, man. I ain't doing shit. I'm sitting here listening to my nigga Montana 300, man. My boy went off. The boy got straight off. I don't know what they... My boy got off. <laughs> Disturbance, but what's up, world man? What y'all on? Um, me, I'm just chilling. You know, I woke up on the good side of the uh, bed today, I should say. You know, energy good, everything was straight, so I was straight. I had got the family together and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Feed them that positive energy. Y'all know how it go. That's what I be on nowadays. I see that the world based on. <clears throat> a lot of energy And the shit around us Is based on a lot of energy You know what I'm saying So it's like I've been focused on that And that's what I've been on At the end of the day though man I've been positive though For the most part Stand by Marley Dowd As y'all can see Smoking them fat joints, the raw joints, pot up, you know what I'm saying? Keep a nigga mental straight. Man, there's been a lot of shit going on in this world. I've been seeing this shit on the news, all type of shit, on YouTube, all type of shit, man. Uh, a lot of shit, killings. Well, first off, killings, you know, it's sort of like, that's first things, first base around the world I've been seeing lately. A lot of wars going on and shit. What's up with Israel? Everything cool over there? You know what I'm saying? I seen some shit about that this morning on there, on the news or whatever, whatnot. Shit crazy. A lot of times, like... When I get on this motherfucker, a lot of times I usually do that. I get on here and I be looking at that shit. I don't always want to tap in about uh, these artists and shit. And it ain't nothing against bloggers that do that. I just don't want to do it because I don't want to feel like, personally, me, I don't want to feel like I'm investigating these bitch ass niggas. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, shit, they going to get in whatever happened, happened to them. Like that. Fuck it. But a lot of times. It be a lot of shit going on, bro. And you got people out here, they be getting themselves, you know what I'm saying, too deep. Like, damn. But anyway, man, like, 
Hey, I've been thinking about doing some more music myself, but I don't think it's gonna be that. My old shooting my bang bang shit I used to do a lot. <laughs> like, I don't think it's gonna be that. I wanna do some more sending messages as songs, like, and not even nothing that the, the higher ups or the government will try to pick up on with they bitch ass. They be trying to be extra slick with all that goofy ass shit, that quiet ass shit. Like, come on, man, ain't nobody on that. Bitch, y'all niggas get exposed. Oh, well, you shouldn't be doing shit in a secret no way. You know what I'm saying? End of the day, I feel like shit. I do want to get back at music. That was my uh, that was my lifeline. I ain't gonna lie. Like, when I did music on my life, I was able to escape whatever I was going through at that time, though. I was, though. I ain't gonna lie about that. What well, son I'm talking about? I'm seeing plenty of shit. What it say? T.I. Sun King almost shoots God calling him fruity. All type of shit. Charleston White, he stay on there, dog. Charleston White, he funny as hell, though. I'll be watching him, though. He funny as hell. Trap boy Freddy, bitch ass, still talking. Them niggas goofy, too, down there. Them goofy ass niggas. Niggas better be smart, man. Start living, folks. Y'all niggas goofy as a bitch. Y'all be sending y'all self up. Want to be extra tough ass niggas out here in the street. Live your motherfucking life, boy. Fuck around with you niggas. Live, nigga. It don't hurt to live. You know what I'm saying? I'm sure it was plenty motherfuckers out here that was like you running around. Tough as fuck. Like, live, bro. Definitely as a black man. Live, bro. We don't come together. Our race weak as a bitch. Lame as hell. We already don't come together. You know what I'm saying? We be killing the shit out of each other. Stupid as hell. Goofy ass niggas. Like, I don't understand it, though. But, at the end of the day, I'm a different breed. I don't flow under that that water line y'all do. I don't. Never did. But nigga learn to live. Like, fuck. Mm -hmm. Me personally, shit, that's all I'm... On at the moment. What well, else out here to be on? Why this pandemic going on? Why the government playing all these chess tricks on niggas in the world? And they pawns. What else can we do? Nigga, get your shit together. Nigga, and get prepared for the next, uh, uh, what? The next, uh, Hunger Game type of shit they got going on out here. Like, that's all that's happening, bro. Y'all gotta pay attention. They be doing a lot of cover ups on murders and shit like that, too. Like, Come on, bro. These people working deep. They working on the inside. They doing underground real work. work. Like, folks, it's, it's crazy. Y'all got to pay attention. <laughs> Open your eyes out here. Open your eyes, man. This shit crazy. A lot of you motherfuckers know exactly what I'm talking about. Hey, a lot of times they want to um silence motherfuckers. Definitely them black celebrities, they be silencing the shit out of them when they get to speaking on what's going on behind closed doors and what's the secret plans on this, that, and the other. You know what I'm saying? This should be crazy. It's crazy. Hey, I've been focused on this shit since I was like, what, 16, 17? Me and my niggas used to sit together talk about shit like that, like... Like with the aliens and shit, bro. Y'all be seeing that shit lately. I don't know. For some of you motherfuckers who watch the news. Bro, I've been saying this shit for years, nigga. <coughs> <coughs> a white boy <coughs> put me on some shit <coughs> a long time ago, bro. And I was shocked that he was putting me on it. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm a black nigga. I'm like, damn. But me and bro, it like not no race thing. Because the first thing you motherfuckers will be watching these videos are, Subject the nigga to being racist Like oh why you had to say it like that 
bitch, I'm, I'm expressing what the fuck I feel like, and that's what I feel like, so that's what I'm going to say, you feel me? But end of the day, <clears throat> he put me on that shit, and I was like, damn, I was real appreciative for the knowledge he put me on because I already was somewhere thinking like that. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, dog, shit crazy out here. How they covering up shit? How shit happening? Like, all that shit. Y'all know, like, with the 9-11, all that goofy ass shit. And you see shit, and then you start paying attention, like, it ain't no coincidence out here. You start peeping shit be happening purposely. It's set up to happen. You know what I'm saying? And I'm sure y'all heard that, like, the systematical setup. That's what the fuck it is, nigga. You got to pay attention. That's what we're going through. So, at the end of the day, I'm like, when is our people going to wake up? When is this race going to wake up? Come on, man. Come on, man. Why you think every other race can stick together but us? When they war against each other, it's usually over a, a religion. I don't know. I honestly can't even say. It's a couple reasons. I just can't pinpoint one reason. But a few reasons I see before religion, for beliefs and shit like that. <clears throat> Us, when we go to war with each other, beef with each other, it's like, we beef for shit like niggas mugging you, stepping on your shoes, niggas and said something on some social media sites, like, y'all niggas probably be too high and then, you got men out here too sensitive nowadays, they want to be bitches and shit, want to be women, on that gay shit, like, that shit tripping, trip me out, at the end of the day, I'm like, mm mm-hmm. it's crazy. Just be the man, bro. You know what I'm saying? Be a man, bro. We need more men out here. For these young niggas out here. Because a lot of young niggas ain't got no guidance. By no strong men. And a lot of people out here don't want to see no strong men out here. With knowledge, too. With a mind. (coughs) They're afraid of that. I think they'd be afraid of the exposure that comes behind that when niggas get real intelligent. So they trick some of these black people folks and put them on platforms, pay them, you know, to make them shun other blacks and put a bad rep. It's crazy. And behind certain shit like that, certain doors get closed for other blacks. <clears throat> it's wild, though. You know, it's like, man. And all that shit coincide with all the killings and murders because people getting driven crazy mentally. To where they like, they feel like, you know what I'm saying? They got to cross the line and do something that they, I don't know, probably shouldn't have to. This shit crazy. I feel like we, everything can get better even, even at the state is in right now, my nigga, like shit. What, that's what the fuck I'm trying to do for the fam. I'm trying to keep everything covered steady. You know what I'm saying? Keep shit moving and grooving. End of the day, though. That's what I want to tap in with y'all today about, man. Just a little bit of, you know, touch up on shit. I know I ain't dropped shit like, what, two days or something. But until the next video, man, until y'all be hearing from me again, y'all keep y'all head up. Stay safe out there, man. Stay positive. Keep the negative energy away from y'all. Don't let nobody trick you out your freedom and stay smart in this motherfucker street. <clears throat> One, carnage. Out.